hey guys how you doing i hope all is well i wanted to come on really quick and um show you guys my hair i had a really good hair day today oh my god i just did a regular twist out up top used my shade moisture just went back to the basics and i um i did flat twist pretty much in the lower back part of my hair and that was pretty much it and I wanted to let you guys know I am six months into my second big chop so I wanted to share that and for you ladies who just started out who been asking me questions on Instagram and inboxing me and leaving comments below you have to just have patience patience is the key when I first cut my hair both times I was like when is my hair gonna grow but I had to realize that you, you need patience and you gotta take care of your hair I like to play in my hair, put my fingers in my hair, and right here, this is a weak spot for me, even when my hair was longer, this piece right here was always shorter when I was relaxed, even me being natural now, it's always a little bit shorter, so you really can't tell now because my hair is tapered, but um, I play in this side a lot, and I tend to pick in it, and it just, I can feel it just popping if I if I pick in it. So that's just a, a habit that I have that I have to break one day, but probably no time soon. And what else is going on? Um, yeah. So let me just show you a little piece of my hair. This is just the front of my hair. I'm not gonna go through the whole big. I'm gonna put a picture up to show you how my hair looked when I first big chop my second time around. So here it goes. Okay. Now. You see my hair now has grown out quite a bit. And my goal when I was three months was to get to my eyebrows. Now I'm way down here. And it's just the top of my, my head. It's not all over because, again, I had a tapered cut. So the top of my head is much longer than the sides. And that's about it. So, ladies, just be patient. Your hair will grow. You know, you just got to give it that TLC. And that's about it. You know, you can't put a certain oil in your hair you can't put a certain cream you can't put a special deep condition and all that stuff and it's gonna like grow magically you have to let your hair your scalp your genetics all that stuff do its thing during its own time and in due time oh, sorry y'all <laughs> your hair will definitely grow you know as i'm looking at my hair now and seeing how my hair has grown I mean, I wasn't paying any attention to it, I want to say, like, after the fourth or fifth month. And then all of a sudden now, I see that my twist in the back getting longer. I can twist my whole head versus me flat twisting back here. And then I'm doing um, finger coils. I can pretty much twist my whole head. So it's all about patience. And I'm sure by the time I get a year, I can just twist the whole thing evenly, nicely, you know. A protective style y'all I really really do but I'm scared I'm sure you guys follow other naturals who have been going through breakage I mean it's like the breakage era going on right now everybody's hair's break I mean ladies who've been natural for two years three years four years they're having major breakage you know I don't know if it's the weather I don't know if it's you know I don't know what it is but I want to do protective style but I'm scared I don't I want to do single leaves I want to do uh, what's the other one box braids but I don't want to sit for for five, six hours just to get braids in my head. And then I don't want the pulling right here. I thought about the Havana twist and Molly twist. But I don't know. Again, I don't want to sit for a long period of time. But I thought about getting a sewing. I didn't want to get a cap. You know, do my own wig and sew on the cap. And then put it on my head. Because I can see myself right now. I know how I am. I'll get to work. Got this cap on with these combs in or whatever the case may be. You part. And then my hair starts to itch. I start scratching it. Take the comb out. Lift it. My supervisor walk by. Next thing you know, my you part to, to the side because I'm playing in it. So I, that's, that's just not good for Kelly. And I thought about getting a sewing. I said I wouldn't get it with the cap on, with the, um, the net. I would just get it sewn on to my, to the braids, to my scalp or whatever. But I said... Uh, I haven't had a sewing in three years. I don't know if I could take that kind of pressure. So I don't know, guys. You, you, I don't know. I just know I want to kind of put it away for a while. But then I'm like, I'm liking it. I want to rock it a little bit. I don't know. We're going to see what's going to happen. And I want to say, hey, to all my new subscribers, I'm 
so happy you're here with me and i'm so happy that the ones that's been with me are still with me i greatly appreciate it i have met some amazing people um i'm just grateful i'm appreciative and i'm glad that you guys are here with me and we're just hanging out and talking about hair <laughs> or whatever we talk about makeup whatever i'm going to start doing some um like fashion outfits of the day i want to get back into thrifting but my schedule is so hectic like just you know i like doing this but i want to do other things too like show you guys other things that i'm into i want to bring my kids on here but i don't know they they, they funny with it so we'll see what happens so that is about it i want to show you about how my hair is doing in these six months and i got some good things coming up ladies i got some nice topics coming up with the natural hair talk and some of the little things i'm gonna i'm gonna bring on here so we can kind of have a good time over here just talk and enjoy each other so thanks for chilling with me and i'll talk to you guys later bye